Hi there, this is Enyo. So you are tuning into my channel. So this is a channel for you to get everything Ghana from an insider's perspective. From markets to historical to cultural tours, everything. Sit back, relax, and enjoy the visuals I'll be sending your way. Also, there's more content for you and come along whilst I explore other parts of Ghana. Hit the subscribe button to see the best of Ghana. Hey guys, on today's video I'm taking you to Mole National Park. So you guys know I was in Tamale and I've done a video about things to do in Tamale. If you haven't seen it, please go back and watch it before coming back to this video. So um, from Tamale, I picked a chotro to Damongo which was 15 cities. At Damongo station, I picked a yellow yellow to Mole National Park. You can also pick a taxi which it will cost you about 30 to 35 cities but the yellow yellow was 15 cities so which was a good deal i could strike so i went with that you can see i got to mole pretty pretty late i stayed at the mole motel and this is the room i shared with my friend and this room was i think 300 and some and 50 cities and we shared this room together yes so it was the next day and we had to go for our safari safari so we picked the walking safari and this is the beautiful view from the Mole Motel overlooking one of the um, cooling or drinking spots of the elephants. So as I mentioned we went for a walking tour and this is our safari guide. So we got a hint that there was an elephant around so we went and we just spotted it and we just observed this elephant from a little bit of a distance because this is their space and you need to respect that. You need to respect that actually so we observe the elephant from a distance and as you can see it's in the background just chilling eating and this elephant actually yeah really throughout i think um 30 minutes of observing it it was eating throughout the entire time yes also um the safari park also has the accommodation of the safari rangers and this is one of uh, the spaces where the rangers live that's their mocks and you can see how close the elephant comes to their settlement where they live the walking safari um, was actually 20 cities per head but this is different with the um, driving safari through the park I think that costs um, I think 300 cities for the car which you split amongst each other and an extra 20 cities each um paid by a person yes so i think that is the difference between the walking safari and the one with the car in terms of accommodation in the mole national park there are two providers so there is mole motel which is um a lot more cheaper because they also have dorm rooms and then there's zena lodge which is bougie so if you want to go for the bougie part you go to zena and if you want to do the budget friendly stuff you do mole motel Spotted this elephant bones close to the settlement of the rangers in the park and we tried to actually lift it to see how heavy it was. It was pretty pretty heavy. If you want to know how heavy it was, it was very heavy. Yeah. We continued deeper into the habitat of different animals in the safari park. And during the walking safari, it's actually two hours. I forgot to mention that. And so during the walking safari, what happens is you observe very very closely things you might actually not observe while on the safari with the van so you observe things like footprints you observe some of the activities of these animals closely yeah so we are on our way to the mole river which is right in front of us and it's one of the major sources of water for these animals in the park
we spotted these butterflies and later these footprints of some antelopes. We came across this water hole where we found six elephants just cooling off and chilling in this water. After our walking safari, we continued to Larabanga mosque to see the oldest mosque in Ghana. So this mosque is built in the Sudan Sahelian style, as you can see. And we went there and we were right in time after prayers. We met with some of the locals, we spoke for a bit and then we continued to the mystic stone. So it was also on the way and we were able to do all these three spots in a day. So thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe, like and share. Ask questions in the comment below and there's more content coming from